In this video, I'm going to do a very brief demonstration of using Business Source Complete. So starting from the library's homepage, I'm going to Articles, Databases, and then I'm going to Browse Databases by Subject, and then I'm going to Business. This gives me a list of business databases. I'm going to Business Source Complete. This is a database from EBSCO. It might look familiar. Um, so I'm going to search for Exxon, but I don't want everything about Exxon, so I'm going to say Exxon and oil spill. And I get 553 articles. Some of them are academic journal articles. Some of them are periodicals. This is Forbes. It's a magazine article. Periodical just means it comes out periodically. And if I went on, on other pages, I might see some news articles from newspapers. Um, I can limit to full text articles here. I can limit by date if I want to. I can limit to scholarly articles. And then when I see the scholarly articles, I can um, go down here and look for an article that looks good to me and open it by clicking on the full text link. PDFs will look like the print periodical. HTML will look more like a web page. Once I have the page um, loaded, there are things over here that I can do with the article. Put it in a Google Drive, print it. If I email it, I can put my own email in here, whatever email I like. I can say I would also like an MLA citation or perhaps an APA style citation. Email it to myself. I can click on this little yellow piece of paper just to see the citations and copy and paste those into a document. I need to proofread them to be sure they've done properly. Um, that's the basics. I can go back to my result list and I can change up my search. If I've decided that I didn't get quite what I wanted, I could do a search on something like oil spill, oil spills and ethics or something like that to get different articles. Um, our databases have articles on everything. So I hope this has been helpful and good luck with your search.